Hi, I'm Sam. And I'm Robin. This week on Electric Dirt, we will be celebrating local musicians who have contributed to the music world in their very special way, but also keeping true to their hometown roots. This episode, our guests will include Sarah Smith, Madison Galloway, and James K. Campbell, better known as Jiggity James. This is Sarah Smith performing The Great Reveal. Good night, my friend I really have to make amends I really hope you'll open up your heart To my unveiling Oh, how I try you away one last time I really hope you'll open up your mind to my unveiling unveiling it's a great Sarah Smith is a singer-songwriter, multi-instrumentalist, soon to be producing her next studio album. She is one of the most tireless musicians Robin and I know, very much grounded with purpose. We had the opportunity to open for Sarah at the Basement Cafe in Minto thanks to Rog Matice at 88.7. She is a gracious, welcoming, and soulful performer. Sarah was born in Guelph and raised on a farm in Arthur with a supportive family. Those years, as she put it, kept her small, with family values coupled with church and community. 
Her musical influences were encouraged by her mother, who was a trained operatic vocalist, and her father, who enjoyed playing guitar and singing. Among many of her musical inspirations, Alanis Morissette stands out for her. Sarah has always been vulnerable in her songwriting. She doesn't know how to do it any other way. Let's listen to Sarah discuss how she writes her music in this interview. Well, a lot of my music comes from kind of inner turmoil place. I write sometimes when I'm dark and when I don't feel like I'm connected. Um, music gives me that connection or that bridge to my emotional stability. So to me, music brings me out of uh, dark emotional places. So sometimes my what I've been writing about the last few albums has been those, those emotions that I can't really clear up without music. I, I need the music to save me and to work me through the emotions. But lately, as of late, the, the music that people haven't really been hearing um, has been really kind of deep, introspective love songs. And uh, it's coming from a different place altogether. So I'm being guided and I'm going with it. I'm going to see what happens to those songs. She continues to tour, playing around 300 dates per year in Canada, the United States and Europe. Along the way, she has shared the stage with artists including Carol Pope, Sash Jordan, Biff Naked, M. Griner, Joel Plaskett, David Wilcox, 5440, among others. Whether it's just her and her acoustic guitar or her full band, she is simply a mesmerizing performer. I just love the feel of this song. This is Sarah and Shine Bright.
Sarah has more pokers in the fire than I could keep track of. Here Sarah talks about her Trust the Ride project and her upcoming engagement on the Melissa Etheridge Caribbean Cruise that's scheduled for November of this year. Okay, well, good question. So um, I was voted in by fans alike as well as the people that are booked for this cruise, for the Melissa Etheridge Cruise 2021. It was supposed to be this year, 2020, but it's been pushed to 2021. And this is a huge opportunity with me. I get to share the stage with Melissa Etheridge. I get to play to her fans on a cruise, meet Jewel and a couple other amazing artists. So to me, it's a it's an absolute dream come true. Trust the Ride, it started out as um, Leslie and I, my partner, we bought a school bus. Um, and we decided that if COVID is, you know, allowing me to sit on my butt here for a while, um, I'm going to do something with my hands and create something uh, with Leslie. We both have been working towards a dream of, you know, just traveling and playing music and being together on the road. So we decided to convert a school bus into a tiny home. So the last few months, we've been putting our sweat and tears into this tiny house, which we've pretty much gotten nowhere with. It's a lot of work, oh, <laughs> and, uh, oh, but along the way, um, our bus name, Trust the Ride, that's the name of us, trusttheride.ca, it's become more about our journey and trusting in the universal guidance that we're receiving. Recently, Sarah's life has taken a new direction. She has relocated to Vancouver Island to continue her musical journey. She is also undertaking the management of a bed and breakfast. Exciting times definitely ahead. Sarah plans to return to southern Ontario in the spring to perform and finish the bus. This is one of Sarah's favorite songs to perform live, Runaway Stay. Where have you been? To the edge of the earth So nothing has come up yet You found somebody new To rescue you You found somebody new To build you up Cause I
Sarah's released five studio albums to date that include live performances and many single releases. She continues to, as she puts it, following her inner voice. Sarah's looking forward to what comes next. She trusts that her music will take her and her listeners where they need to go. We are certain there are big things in the future for Sarah Smith. Coming up after the break, James K. Campbell, a.k.a. Jiggity James. <laughs> 